Hello Knight here, welcome back to my Athens campaign. We're up to episode 41. Uh, I'll just give you a quick overview of what's happening. We've just um, declared war on media, which are these guys. We've taken out their churches along the north coast of Africa, in Libya and Egyptus. We're moving south to take the last few territories. It's a war target of their territory across here in Arabia. Uh, we're at war with Dragania. Perhaps it would help if I did this, actually. We're at war with Dragania. Um, we've recently taken out the territories around here. We're just moving up the Mesopotamia province through the Euphrates um, Valley. And we're going to take out these two cities. Uh, the aim then is to take the whole of Saudi Arabia. Arabia, rather, Peninsula. And then move along, take out these, go into Egypt. Um, we're going to keep allies, I think, with Syracuse. And then we'll move all our armies up to this border here. And literally just sweep through Europe uh, towards the Macromanai. We actually look quite powerful. We're actually getting quite large opponents, to be honest. They're getting quite big empires, these guys. Tertatani, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 territories. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. The Shurisku look as if they've got quite a few as well. So, right, let's get back to the game. Um, all the action's in the east at the moment. Um, I can't remember if I'm actually doing anything in some of these cities actually over here. I need to have a quick whiz through and see. I think the public order is fine. Can't remember if there's anything I've destroyed that I need to upgrade. Getting lots of cash at the moment, of course. Tanis. We can expand that city. Don't need to at the moment. Okay, same here. We can expand here as well. Right, nearly there, I think. Should really look at this in connection with the public order, actually, to be honest. Let's have a look. So, we need to look at Transoxania, Cilicia, as usual, and the two territories we've just captured. That makes more sense. Transoxania. There's Maracanda. Plus 11, so that's obviously historical, that problem. I'm just keeping one building over here to... Um, just in case I need a barracks to build some troops. Uh, we've just taken this, haven't we, I think? 23. Military presence. Well, that's the army in Seleucia. So we need to do something here, I think. Going to destroy that. Loads of food. Some grove. Do that. Five and fifty. Okay, um, Okay, don't think we'll do any more upgrading. Oh yes, we've got a stray army over here, haven't we? Which we're going to need to, the Draganian army, which we need to take out. So we'll move up to this valley here. We're positioning ourselves ready to attack Sagacia. Okay, I don't really care about the trespassing side of things, to be honest. We're going to attack them next turn. Muscat is quite anti sagacia at the moment, so we don't need to worry about that. There was a fleet down here, ten of them, from Dragania. They don't look too good, actually, to be honest. Too good a state. Um, yeah, we need to try and get this army released if we can. Oops, got anything there. What are we building here? Minus four public order. Why did I do that? It's weird. I don't know why I decided to build that. It's just 
that would just be stupid to be honest. Minus four public order. Well, we've already got a public order problem. Mitchell Prince has given us ten. Yes, definitely do not want to um, increase any public order problems. Okay, I want to try and move this army out as soon as possible. Okay. Um, right, what's happening over here? Do I have an army? Oh no, I've moved the army over, haven't I? Right, okay, let's take out Hatra. Obviously I'm going to auto-resolve this. Another territory. And we're moving across the um, desert to attack Hatra, Hatra, Hatra. Temple of Poseidon, what the hell? What's the point of a Temple of Poseidon in the middle of a... <laughs> it's in the middle of a landmass. Um, I don't think, I don't think, we can't get on the Sacred Grove side of it, so I'm going to destroy that. Weaponsmith we're getting rid of, so we're going to increase a couple of temples, I think, there. Yeah, I need to look at Mesopotamia fairly soon. Seleucids. Seleucids. Seleucids, that's fine. Right. What do we got? We need to send one army over to take out Jura. And we need to, oh Dragania. Suffering attrition. Which is something we do not want to suffer, so we're gonna move by road as opposed to is that all? Can't really see anything about that guy. Okay, can I get what do you wish a noble woman to do some business here? Deploy them. I'm not really sure what this does, but anyway. Shalamar. Shalamansa, not Shalamar. Um, right, we're doing stuff here. Don't think he can hit Seleucia. We can come back anyway. He's in normal stance, so we'll move to here. Okay. I think that's we're okay on the armies. Slightly taking a slight risk that the Draganian army will backtrack and attack Seleucia, but we've got troops around that can deal with that if he takes it. Um, yeah, we shouldn't have too much trouble dealing with that. Was that Hanging Gardens of Babylon? I believe it is. It's a wonder. I thought they'd kind of like expiated all those. They'd take them all out anyway. Um, all right, I'm gonna. It this way, I find, because I've got so many troops and armies now, I don't really know what I'm doing, whether I've moved all of them or not. Okay. Right. Yathrub. Marib. Let's try and move down to Marib. Get some more information. Looks like we'll be attacking the Sabah soon. Let's upgrade. Don't know why I did that really. <laughs> um, let's upgrade them. So I hadn't actually built anything in in there. Oh yes, we've got a fleet here. Well, this fleet is gonna. We'll send it over to try and help our Spartan guys, our Spartan allies against the Reati. Not quite sure how many how many cities we could actually attack. Um, we're after this guy, aren't we? No, we're not. Yes, we are. Media, the Grudge of Salamis. Oh, that's good. We're not suffering attrition. So maybe we'll be able to hit him next go and get rid of him. A lot of guys coming back that way. I got the armies. 
nothing along here, but I think public order is fine. Yeah, I think even in Alexandria, I think it's fine. Yeah, so we don't need to do anything else at the moment. What's this guy doing? Is he deployed? I don't know what deploying means, but a slight risk that units will come across here with my fleets out of the way, but not much, not much of a risk. Um, Ready for battle. Can we hit them? Oh, this army can only get as far as here. So we'll just move to here so they can support. I think I might keep this army here, just in case they move, these guys move up towards Alexandria. Um, this is the war aim, war target, so there's lots of stuff going on here. See the old eagle flying above the city. Okay, where was I? I think I was just trying to work my way through, wasn't I? Yeah, Champions of Olympus, they've got all their movement left, we're not moving them. And he's with them. So I think that's it, I think we can start thinking about upgrading things again. Try and improve things, more wealth. Need wealth rather than food at the moment. Okay, let's move on to another territory. Eight minus eight food. I've not really got a big enough public order thing there, to be honest. Not really insulated enough for public order. Yeah, these are all costing. Okay, let's go a trading port. That's only minus. Yeah, go for that. Oh, we've got a trading port. What can we go up to? Docks. No, they're all they're all basically going to cause us problems. Those in public order terms. Um. Squalor, squalor. Perhaps I need to expand the city and then build something. Armavir, there we go. Let's have a look what we can build. Outskirts, that's a good. That's a good thing to have. Okay, move on to the next province. Pura. It's got fishmongers. It's actually inland. So, is it because there's a lake there? A port? That is so weird. You can build the docks, but it's inland. How strange. That is very, very odd. I think maybe that's a glitch. It shouldn't you shouldn't be able to build docks inland, should you? That's just stupid. Okay. Tomopolis. Let's see what we can build here. Outskirts. I'm going outskirts crazy actually. Span the city. <coughs> Excuse me. And we're gonna outskirts there. Let's expand the city. Outskirts there. Um, no. No. Is there anywhere else we can expand? I thought there was somewhere to the north. Yeah, Tanis. So we're gonna expand over here in Tanis. That was weird. That didn't seem to expand very much, did it? Homestead. What's public order like over here? 
pretty damn good actually. I'll we'll go for that, I think. Yeah, we'll go for a homestead. And who else we can expand? Oh, Bactria. Well, that was a big area that expanded. Outskirts. Okay, and we're done. I don't think there's anything di diplomatically I want to accomplish. Um, I might try Syracuse to see if Athena we can get. Give you wisdom so that you may speak well and persuade me of your cause. Be welcome. Success low. Okay. Going to end a turn. See what media does, Dragania. So there's a lot more housekeeping now, isn't there? The Empire's getting big. I really want to take out this fleet if I can. Draganian fleet. Um, uh, media fleet. I think the Seleucids seem to be taking a bit of a licking off the, um... Guys, they're fighting. Oops, we're in trouble. Why is he attacking my agents? He's not attacking my armies, is he? That's the way to look at it, I think. Ah, he's gone back towards Seleucia, and they've gone back towards Hatra, I think. Yeah. Okay, that's something I wouldn't have expected. I thought he would have let loose on my eastern cities, to be honest. That would have been his best bet. He could have taken two or three whilst I was pursuing him. But anyway, I'm sure a human player would have done that. But anyway, we'll see. See if we can catch him now. Ah, they are moving north. So I need to move an army back, I think. To Alexandria. Because, of course, my fleet can destroy and then get back in. To Sagatai, hopefully, they're moving across my territory to back us up. They are allies. They're reliable as well, apparently. So let's hope they don't attack us. And we're back. I've got the slaves, haven't we? Sorry. Slaves must have a city somewhere. Someone's died. Oh. Stephanos. He's a bit of a boss. Okay. Egypt has been destroyed. Okay. Okay. Pop Diva. I'm going to build 20 field, that's no good. Let's do public order, plus do growth, Agora. Population surplus in Cilicia. Expand the city of Tarsus. I think... I We're barely... I think we're going to go for a temple, to be honest. Public order. Go for an Agora. Okay. Spide Populous, Charisma, Trait Gained. Lots of stuff. Built Cyprus and Dragania. That's interesting. I didn't know that Cyprus existed. I thought they were part of Seleucids. Well, I need to do something about my science. I'm going to go for this. Noble Death. You're not interested. I don't really have much invested in the old generals, you know, to be honest, in terms of like, um, right, so, okay, so we're not going to be able to move back into Alexandria, the friends of the Nereids need to pursue this fleet and get rid of it, there's 14 ships, what have we got here, so I need to move back in, I think, um, of course he can actually... What has Alexandra got? Five. It's got rubbish, actually. Absolutely rubbish. Um, but he has actually let me take this. Which is a better army. 
they're both pretty good actually. Let's take out Dose Bolas. That was rather silly. So that we moved in at almost like 4% cost, which is very good. I like those kind of odds. Group of nymphs. Gotta get rid of that. This guy. Oof, um, can't really get back all that far, can he? Get into. Oh, I wonder whether I could have hit him then, you know? Perhaps I could have actually gone across and destroyed him. That would have been better rather than tying down two armies. <clears throat> yeah, maybe it was a bit foolish there. I should have really attacked him. Yeah, that would have solved it, to be honest. Well, saying that, he's got a bloody good army. <laughs> I'm really starting to hit very good quality troops. I'm wondering if my slinger armies and hoplites are going to be up to it, to be honest. I'm going to have some difficult battles, I believe because none of these are upgraded in terms of their experience or anything so I might start to hit a bit of a wall um, can't do anything more there I need really to get moving and get my armies in gear let's have a look and see what's happening over here we had an army here didn't we can we reach him? ooh I'm not sure whether we can I'm going to try don't think we can but We'll get as close as possible. No, we can't. So we'll go towards the city. Can he reach Sharax? If he can, we'll take it out anyway. Right, okay. And this guy was going to... He could have taken it to Barnard, couldn't he? Well, he could have attacked it anyway. We're going to have to come through here and try and take this guy out. Um, let's add to their problems. Yep. Gosh, non-existent again. Non-existent garrison. 97. 97 will do me. Yep, straight through the vitals. So it had an axe, actually. It's the first time I've seen that, I think. Okay. Double look at Jura. Don't really have much. Palmyra has got a pretty crap temple, hasn't it? Um, I think longer term, we're always going to have problems here. Minus 28. I think I need to destroy that. Build a temple. Right, okay, it's got an army there. Can we actually block this guy off? We're fine here, 17, which is good. Your next command. Again, that's weird. Charax, oh no, that's on the sea, isn't it? That's fine. That does actually make sense. Okay. dragania has got a lot of agents around. Commander. If he comes out of his force march and then attacks us, we might be in trouble. I, I, I don't think so. But we might, because it looks like a pretty good army to me. Thorax Swordsman. Oh, I don't know. Tarantine, Tarantine. I don't really like Tarantine. There are expensive mounted slingers, as far as I'm concerned. Um, this guy's coming round, isn't he? So this guy should be sandwiched. He's got 15 odd troops, but... Should be able to attack him and get rid of him. We need to move on to Ready for orders. these guys or oh, cancel the move oh why did I do that am I going to cancel the move no I'm not I think I'm going to try and take these cities Commander. declare war as I thought let's take them out 91 90 91 that'll do 
and I'll see if I can get peace with Sabah and um, and Sabah, really. It's ranked up. Oh, I can get s oh, I can get 15 armies now. That's good. Ten fleets. Number of edicts five per turn. That's good. Um. Trading port. Trading port? Oh yeah, that's fine, isn't it? Run of nymphs. Could do without the squalor, to be honest. Won't do anything with that at the moment. Gonna get rid of that. Um, minus 17, but most of that will be the stuff from this term, won't it, I would think. Right, okay. So Dragania should be suffering a lot of attrition now. I don't think they have any territory left. No, Dragania has no territory left. It has armies, obviously, but no territory. I'm going to try and get peace with Sabah. Where are they? S Sabba. Am I always to be disturbed by Yeah, they're just such wusses, aren't they really? Uh, was Sagacia, Dragania, and Media. That's okay, I think. Um Media's got one territory left, I think. Maybe more than that actually. Let's have a look. Media's got one, two territories left. Sagacia has one territory left, which we're about to take out. It's a territory in the middle of the um, Arabian Desert. Again, they're like non-existent. 99. Headshot. Okay, it's good. Let's move in. He's ranked up. Okay. What's in there? Adamantu. Raw barracks. Mm, we're going to get rid of that. Oops. I don't need a raw bats in the middle of a desert, do I? There's nothing in the desert. And no man needs nothing. It's a slight risk. No, we don't need to do that to at the moment. Oh, could actually... Yeah, I think I'm going to have to start doing this, to be honest. Can I? Why, why would it not let me go do them as a group? This is most annoying. But I have to go through and do all of them. Not worried about the slingers, they won't get into hand to hand combat, so I'm not bothered about all the general to be honest. Uh, right, so how are things looking now? We should be looking a lot better. The guys who I'm fighting against don't have any territories basically, don't have any cities. So they should start to suffer a lot of attrition. I need to look at public order in Armenia, Cilicia, and Gidrosa. Need to see if we do anything more down here. I think I was doing something, wasn't I? Um, Aurea actually was a city. Oh, I got that wrong. It wasn't that it was um, Pura had the had the port, so there was nothing wrong with that at all. My apologies. Hmm. 
So you're still minus three, and ten of that is a military presence. Ten public order. Eight public order. So I think we'll be able to move that out next turn. And we may come across and take out Muzgat. Muzigat. Okay. What? Okay, I think much more we can do militarily. Yeah, I don't think we can attack this guy. No, I can't get anywhere near him. These guys have moved. So just have a look. I've got my fleet to move, haven't I? Yeah, I'm going to move them, continue to move them over towards the Reatai. At least we can maybe see them in battle. These guys are going over to attack these as soon as we can. Um, Champions of Olympus, they've moved into here to protect it. Okay. Let's deploy this noble woman. Let's deploy this person. Right, the spy, she's moving down towards Murrib. Got near here, we over in the north, I think. I oh, know over here. Just need a bit more information further south, I feel. Gonna need information on the, the Blemies. Um is there anything more I want to upgrade? I'll be sitting on money. Might be getting a bit dizzy here, but I'm just going to whip through my territories and see if there's anything I can upgrade. I think I expanded all these slots where there was areas that were population surplus. Yep, we're back. We're back. I think it was here that there was slight... Yeah, there was, wasn't there? Sure there was. And it's Silesia again. I think Silesia, we were doing something about that, weren't we? Yeah, we're building Agora. Okay, I think we definitely need to end the turn. Oh, an assigned skill. I forgot to check that. I thought I was getting quite good at this, but obviously I missed. There we go. Demons off. There we go. I'm going to give him some authority. He looks quite low on authority, that guy. Oh god, provincial edicts, okay. I can put one down here actually, can't I? That may actually... Let's go for bread and games. If I can get that. Ooh, bread and games. Right, okay, that should help things to turn things around there. It's very good that it reminded me actually. I would have forgot about the fifth, the fifth um, edict. Not quite sure what my fleet's going to do over here, to be honest. But it's no point in having it where well, it's not being used. And if I'm going to head north through the Balkans, there aren't many ports in the Balkans, are there? So I might as well help the um, Spartans against the Rietai. Let's see if there's any counterattack by the um, Sagations or the Draganii. Yeah, absolutely. So as I could attack Cyprus and take that out. That'd probably be worth doing. With the fleet that I've got, um, that's going to take out the media fleet. Let's musk it up to. Media seems to have a few more. Oh gosh. I'm going to have to chase this all over the bloody eastern Mediterranean, aren't I? It's really annoying. Ah, sagations, what are we going to do? Some more sagation ships, is it? Or troops? Not really sure. To Sagata are making um, a long journey, aren't they? Okay. 
Okay, we're almost there. I'm just going to have to chase around after this fleet. I can't go into them. Um, what's worse, I can't go into um, oh, plus seven. Okay, but ten of that is, so I still need to upgrade. Still need to do some work. In four, Sacred Grove. It's really expensive keeping an army here, actually. Got two in a way because we've got Draganian there. Draganian forces. Here, I think we're okay, aren't we? Gera. Oh, what's public order like? 18, 20 of 15, 20 of that is. I think we need a temple. And I don't know, can I go for an outskirts? I'll go for a temple. Okie doke. start doing this actually because I'm going to be running up against quite high quality elite units by the looks of it. They're not going to be spamming out slingers and pikemen. Okay. He doesn't have a war aim at the moment, that guy, because we will be coming down to attack Muzgat uh, with the army that's up here. We're pursuing the... where did that army go? The Draganian army. That's a bit annoying. Lost track of where it is. Oh, it's still... it's actually just sat there. So we'll attack that in an open field battle. Woohoo! Right, so we move there. We move here. Uh, go for a night attack. What does that do? I don't think you'll be able to see anything if I go for a night attack, and it doesn't seem to actually help things at all. Shall I fight this? I mean, he's got absolutely no chance. Ah, uh, no. Let's kill him. He's ranked up. Okay. Oh gosh, he's getting a lot. Okie doke. Need to move down here. Ready for further orders. Need to upgrade. Need to move this army down as well. Gee, also upgraded. Let's go for that. Right. Okay. okay. So we haven't completely killed them by any means, so we need to get after them again. Oh, another night battle general, that's good. After him and finish him off. So let's go back a moment. Does it make any difference? Doesn't seem to, does it? 95, whatever happens. Oh. Okay. Gera? I don't think we do. Actually, we've got two armies over here. We're we'll bringing the army over from Judosia uh, by Hamazoa to attack here. We've got this army here. 
that we like on public order should be fine soon. Doing a lot of upgrading there. Um, so where am I going to attack? I need to attack across towards the Blemies and the Saba. Isn't it? They're the, they're the next enemies that I'm going to face. Dura, that's temple. Where's the road? What sort of public order have we got there? Changes for nearly all of that is Okay, well we'll go for that. We'll go for that. Uh, what are we looking at? We're looking at possibly taking out Cyprus, weren't we? Who are they allied with? Cyprus, they like us and they're trading with us. 435. They're at war with lots of people. They're unreliable, but they're not allied with anyone. I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to attack Cyprus by sea. That'll be interesting. I want to get to use our our guys. I think we've got to let's move this guy up here. Can we help the? Oh gosh, the Macromani! Wow, they've really expanded. Are we friendly with them? Ma. For Macromani. We're trading. Greetings. Now speak plainly. For we are an honest folk and very Oof, honest I don't like that. Oof. Gold. You have much, and our people do not wish to become the slaves of envy. Not, not that greedy, are they? I've got a feeling they've they've got a huge territory actually here. Look at this. Ooh, I think we could find ourselves at war with the Macromani soon. Anyway, so we need to move on as quickly as possible. Uh, let's get back to Middle East. I just need to get my head straight now. What I'm going to do media we need to take out so we need a bit of a, a push through here just to finish off the last few territories um, we're only at war with media aren't we I think oh no we're at war with um, quite a few but they haven't got any territories have they that's the Dragania and also the other tower other um, yeah Dragania and I can't think of the other guy we're fighting Sagacia, isn't it? They don't have any cities. So we just need to destroy Myos Homus. That should be my main aim. So I need to try and get there, basically. I don't think I can actually get there very easily without attacking across the territory of the Sabah. Can I? No, I can't actually. The Blemies and the Sabah. So I need to position myself ready to attack the the blemies. Well we can leave that for a turn or so to let public order sort itself out which it is doing which I'm grateful for just doing some random upgrading to try and get some more money you see our money is really good now and our food is really good um, okay what am I doing here? What am I going to do? I need to have a think about what I'm going to do here. I think basically I need to position ready to attack the Blemies and the Saba. Uh, that's, what, that's what I need to do, basically. We now know where all the cities are over here. Um, let's move this spy back actually. I'd like to keep an eye on what's happening up here. Right, so he's gone into fortified mode, so that's kind of a nothing thing to do. 
So we can probably, we could attack him. Can this guy move any further? He can't, can he? We put him into normal stats. We can move to here. And we're going to move this guy up to here. So we're fighting a battle here against an, a fortified guy. But first of all, I think we're going to have a bit of fun. We don't get much fun here, do we? Um, no, let's not call on my allies to join in. Okay. Oh my god. Oh god, look. Look, I'm going to fight this because I just don't get bored. <laughs> I just think, oh, it might be slightly interesting. We'll have some fun with the, um, yeah, let's have some fun. Let's fight it. He has absolutely no chance whatsoever against me. Um, but we'll give it ten minutes, or five minutes probably, for the battle. I've not taken a city from the sea before, so this will be an interesting rehearsal. I think we're going to have to do that a lot in the western Mediterranean, when we start attacking across the... Um, the map. He's got some ships actually, you might be able to sink them before they even get, get to the um, shore. I doubt it somehow, they'll probably land. And in fact, thinking about it, people have said on forums that you, there won't be enough space for me to actually move all my ships ashore. But I'll be using my um, ballista, my um, onagers rather, from the sea. So I only need um, 5, 10, 14 areas, 20, there needs to be 20 20 slots for me to get ashore, if you know what I mean. If you can think what I mean, you know what I mean. Um, right, I, these ships are probably going to be in here, so we're not going to be able to catch them. Okay. Those are those guys. Oops, don't want to do that, do I? Just create a group. I put these guys over on this shore. Did we actually get them into a formation? Apparently we did. I just want to use some onagers on a town, to be honest, because yeah, so I'm getting a bit bored with this. Not getting much pleasure out of it, are we? Uh, got the thorax guys in the front, or not all of them actually. Okay. Oh god, damn it! Look where they are. Row hard. Right, we'll um, let's see if we can come ashore over here. God, it's miles, isn't it? Is there actually a is there a way to actually land here? Is there a beach? Perhaps there isn't. So they have actually screwed up on a lot of this. Um, oh. He's actually come out to attack me, which is interesting. Yes, go on. Why is it going backwards? Why is that ship going backwards? Crash in. Oh, he just bounced back off of it. Oh dear. That's these ships you know they're sunk okay so that's why let's get me guys sure I can't 
really doing much against these guys, these axemen, they're already ashore. He sent one ship out to delay me. Quite clever actually, to be honest. Now they've landed, I don't need to worry about. Uh, we'll send these guys over here. Artillery, let's see if we can take out some people. Actually, we're already firing, which is a bit weird. Okay, let's move these guys here. Let's take them off fire at will, so I want to control what's going on. I need to land down there. God, I can't actually land anywhere. Anyway. Sit some cavalry. Throw a spear. They're just on the beach at the moment. So in a moment I shall be attacking them. Now can we actually get ashore? Let's have a look. I don't think I can actually get ashore here, to be honest. Can they? I don't think you can get ashore, mate. Down here, down at the beach. Gotta be very careful or we're going to run out of space. Can we actually land in the... I think we might be able to land actually in the... We'll send two around. We'll send three around actually. If we can actually get, I think that he's actually taken up the positions in the dock. Um, so I don't think we can do very much, to be honest. We might be able to, I'm not sure. Right. Got some land units as well I can use. Let's use, can we use, oh no, we're going to use normal stuff, let's group these guys together for fire control, and we'll just attack these guys. Can we actually get everyone ashore here? I don't think we can actually. Oh, oh there's shit moving there actually, by the looks of it. This is a bit worrying. Are they actually going to get off, off the ship? Doing some damage here. I wonder if I can actually destroy their ships and then use the... Um... Right, I have no expectation that I'm going to be able to do this, but I'll send a ship round and we'll see if we can... Can we land here? Here? I don't think we can. Ah, is there a spot there? I'm sure I saw the old... No, I think he's already in that spot, aren't they? So I'm going to have to send these guys back. They didn't really, when they designed the, f the actual game, they didn't really give enough space for you to get your a 20 stack on board. Okay, so are we moving or is he just stuck or seems to be stuck this guy. Where are my ships? Oh of course, actually on land now. Of course they are. Let's move those guys over. 
He's taking a lot of damage, I'm hopeful to see. Let's just keep hitting them till they're destroyed. Yeah, these are obviously totally glitched. I can't do anything with them. It does annoy me this game at times. Okay, let's move these two guys over. Can he really not do anything? I row hard. They're stuck. I'm not going to be able to get these guys off the ship. So we're seven patches into the game and the, you still cannot actually deploy your men. It's just so bad, isn't it? I keep moving about. Maybe eventually we'll be able to get them free. Right, let's go back and have a look over here. This hasn't been as much fun as I thought it might have been, to be honest, to be candid with you. Yeah, let's go for them. Let's destroy this unit. They're shattered. Our spears are done. Keep hitting those guys. They can probably start bringing up my Thorax Swordsman. I've got much in the way of intelligence on the place, but um, so you'd have some slingers. 19, 20 odd slingers. Okay, right, I don't know why I'm bothering about taking all these other guys off. Can we actually get, get ashore now? So if we are actually getting something now. We can probably actually hit, hit the centre of the place from the beach. Which would be fun. Why well, I don't want them to go ashore, do I? The Ross Spears are taking heavy, heavy hits. 35 of them. Kind of hiding behind here, aren't they? I'm going to move the other, the other guys um, in a bit closer. Actually, see if we can reach. Why can I not get control of this ship? It's interesting this, this is a good rehearsal for gonna, this guy here, they can just fire on them from like 20 feet away, they don't have any. Right, have I finally got these guys off? Right, let's begin the march on the town. Just far on here. Whoa. What's going on here? Go on. Kill him. Whoa, that got a load of them. So we're getting some fun, but not much. <laughs> okay. Let's have a look. Where are they? Oh, sorry about that. Oh, there's the city. Okay, let's go back. They're finished, so we'll move this ship over to here. Oh no, I want to continue. I want to try and use these guys to take them out. Are they running? Oh, god damn it. 
Alright, let's quit the battle. Well, I didn't lose anyone. They lost 508. That kind of, that kind of sums things up, really, for the game at the moment, how it stands. The fact that you, you struggle to actually find spaces to put your, your men ashore. It's kind of almost there, but not quite. They need to do a bit more work on the old pathfinding stuff. Salamis. Does that mean we've got the whole of um, the area now? Oh no, I don't think it does, does it? Let's have a look. Oh, do you know what? It does. Salamis, that's really excellent. We're going to destroy that. We're going to destroy that. Oh no, we're going to grove of nymphs that up. Can't do anything there. Ooh, that's in C day, isn't it? Do a bit of development work here. No, can't do anything more there. Certainly don't want a slave. Gonna get an Agora there. Right, so we don't want any more problems with public order. We've got minus 32. 25, 9, 3 turns, but we should find that we're okay actually. Um, don't think we can do much in the way of attacking this guy now. Probably need to keep the army in there, or the navy are in there. It's 18 at the moment, minus 18, 32. Why are we getting building squalor? 34, that's just so random, you know. Sorry, I'm going to have to build another temple, I think. That's the only answer. But at least we have another territory, another province. Um, okay, let's have a look. I'm gonna, no, let's do it that way. Um, we're at war with media. Obviously these rebels we're at war with. Um, next turn we'll be fighting this battle here in Egypt, just over here, the light bringers, but we'll be sending them into the darkness. Okay, um, that's a bit dark, <laughs> so we will be attacking them next turn and I'll be fighting it out as well. So you're getting spoilt this episode. You had a sea battle, and the next episode you might have another battle. The sea battle was pretty useless, actually, wasn't it, really, to ask the assault. The Grudge of Salamis. Okay. He could, he could pose a problem, I suppose. 14 units. I suspect they're very, very depleted. One would hope so, from their flag. Um, I've still got a fleet here that can pursue after them, go after them and destroy them. don't think we can actually move it out at the moment. Okay, I hope you've enjoyed the episode. Um, let's just have a look at my territories. As you can see, we've got quite a big empire now. Transoxania we might be able to put into taxation, actually. Let's have a look. Oh, yeah. Another 805. So, everyone, everything's being taxed now. Um, not quite sure how many we've actually got now, to be honest. Let's look at my territory. We've got 74. Okay, so we've still got another uh, 36, no, 26. Uh, it's 140 for the objectives. I think it is, you know. Ultimate objectives, 140. Right, okay. 140. We've got lots of naval units. We haven't quite got the three naval navies that we need. We'll maybe concentrate on building another navy up, I think, next. Yes, that is what we shall do. So next time we'll start building another navy in Nicomedia. That will give us the... the we'll be maintaining the 60 naval units. Um, 
we not got Magnagrisha? I don't think we have actually. That's owned by Sparta. So we're going to have to attack Sparta at some stage. Egyptus we'll have soon. Africa we may have eventually. Magnagrisha. I'm trying to think of who controls that. No, isn't it so much... No, we actually our allies are holding that. It might be Garabentia or someone. Gatula, I've got um, one of those over here. Okay. Chapter objectives. We've reached 20, so we get 16,000 apparently. Okay. Yeah. Or oh, the following faction, Egypt. Well, they're friends of ours, not going to do that. In fact, they don't exist anymore anyway. Nabatea we need to get next. We'll get 6,000 for that. Okay. So what's that? That's 74, that's 26. 66 we still need, so we're actually only, although it may not seem like it, we're only just over halfway through the game. This is a massive game, isn't it? Really massive. We will be getting obviously some more territories in Arabia and Egypt, Libya. We'll hold fire, we won't attack um, Syracuse. I don't think so, though, unless the circumstances change. Um, I say most of our armies will probably be coming up to attack these people, the Lugi, the Cherusku, the Bastani, yeah, it's called DC. We're moving up through the Balkans, I think, that'll be the best way. We'll have a single front and we're moving ahead with our armies behind us, etc. And we're just coming a big sweep right the way through Northern Europe, down into France and then down to Spain. And I think by then we should be close to winning. I hope. Okay. All right. I hope you've enjoyed the episode. Um, we'll speak to you soon. And here's the battle you've got to look forward to. There's um, what I've got here. Two armies, 40 against 20. So we two to one. Right. Okay. Keep well. I'll be speaking to you soon. Bye for now.